Hello from Glacier 3000 here in Switzerland and it's fair to say I'm buzzing. This place was closed earlier in the week to high winds but look at it absolutely glorious the perfect day to get up here and explore about a 10 minute drive from my accommodation in Diablo Ray. Glacier 3000 is included on the Magic Pass this year. I don't know whether it will be in future years. It's normally at a premium, but let's go check it out. gonna cry when you're gone Where will you go? Won't you miss the ones you know? I'll be here hanging on waiting for your call Seems like time As a wave passing by Leave a mark in our minds to turn the memories River's gonna cry when you're gone, 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 gone River's gonna cry when you're Wow, so at the top of this run, which is fantastic by the way, I'll chuck the name on screen I was talking to one guy and his words were Unbelievable, why is there no one here? Look at this place Whew. Let's keep going What a ride! Woo. So there's a little bit of a traverse to get into it and this weird like rope toe style lift brings you out here at Oldenshire. But I love this sport. Finding new and interesting places to ski and snowboard. Woo. This place, look at that. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action. What we can be, life with no distractions. We'll get away. This is what we waited for Take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out I'm done living life with the lights out Die with my own doubts Be free Something not to miss and included with your lift pass here in Glacier 3000 is the Tissot Peak Walk. Two peaks, a 107 meter metal suspension bridge and views to die for. Diablo Ray back that way, Mont Blanc that way, over into the Sunshine, Zermatt and the Matterhorn. This has to be one of the best viewpoints that I've come across in all of the resorts on this trip. So 
know, the majority of terrain here at Glacier 3000, if we're talking about peace, is stuff like this. Mellow, cruisy blues. There's a couple of lovely reds and a great black thrown in. But I think the most exciting terrain is found away from the peace. Free ride here is pretty well known. So I mentioned that in terms of the piste terrain here, it can be quite mellow. But mellow's great. And when you combine mellow with views like that over towards the Matterhorn, there's not a lot more that I want in a ski area. At Glacier 3000, you're gonna spend most of your time riding T-bars or surface lifts, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. As I mentioned earlier in the week, the chairlifts up here were closed because of high wind, but these, can always run or at least pretty much always run which means this area is accessible most of the time even in high winds in addition to the t-bars that you're going to find as surface lifts at glacier 3000 you also have this bad boy i've actually never been on one of these it's like a little rope toe uh, but with a neat little handle and a button to go between your legs Glacier 3000 is really well known for its terrain park. They have a half pipe, which is just being built behind me, and further up that way, they are building the jump line. Nothing's open yet, which is a shame. I'd love to come back here when it was to check it out. One of the things that makes Glacier 3000 stand out and be a bit of a rose in the crown of Diablo Ray, Villars and Grion is that it has a very long snowshore season. So you can actually ski and snowboard up here on the glacier from November all the way through until May. That is it for today at Glacier 3000 and what a day. The snow conditions up here were perfect, but then you'd expect that for a resort with this altitude. I must say it is one of the most stunning ski resorts that I have ever skied in. Everywhere you look, 4,000 meter peaks all around. I'd love to hear from you. Have you been to Glacier 3000? Do you have any questions? Make sure to drop them in the comments below and I will see you next week with another video. As always, I really appreciate you guys watching so thanks and I'll see you next week